The city of Garland says it is closely monitoring air and water quality after a fire and some explosions at a paint manufacturing plant. Hello, I'm Steve Eager. Hello, everybody. I'm Heather Hayes. That explosion shook buildings and homes in the early morning hours today, but the city says its initial testing showed nothing hazardous enough to warrant evacuations. The Sher Sherman William Sherwin Williams plant is in a mostly industrial area. It's north of LBJ Freeway off Shiloh Road. Fox 4's Alex Boyer has an update now on the investigation. In the the explosions. Alex. Hey guys, you know, 911 calls came in from as far as five miles away saying that they felt the ground shake. Now I'm going to step out of the way and as we push in here along a Shiloh Road, you can see what the scene looks like at this hour. Now those 911 calls began pouring into Garland Police just before 1.30 this morning. A spokesman with the Garland Fire Department says there are 17 buildings on this massive site. The fire is out and one person is injured. Drone footage taken by a Fox 4 viewer captured part of the massive explosion at the Sherwin-Williams plant in Garland early Monday morning. On the ground, people who live and work near the facility located off Shiloh Road near Forest Lane said they were literally shaken awake by a series of blasts that began just before 1.30 in the morning. Well, it felt pretty hard and, you know, felt pretty, um, like the whole house shook, so I thought maybe somebody was trying to break in or something. Um, I didn't realize it was something else until somebody else told me. All of a sudden, the, we hear this big boom and this building shakes on us. It just shakes. And then the particles from the ceiling started falling down, and, but the ceiling didn't collapse. It was the particles around the ceiling. That the Garland Fire Department responded within minutes and called for extra personnel immediately. A spokesman said firefighters working on 16 apparatus, including nine fire trucks, were able to get the fire contained within an hour and a half. This is an industrial uh building that's right uh, in an industrial area, but within a quarter mile of homes. Sky 4 captured the aftermath. You can see the extent of the fire damage done to the paint manufacturing plant. Officials say one employee was injured and treated on scene. The rest of the employees were evacuated and accounted for. Forest Lane between International and Shiloh Road was closed to traffic for hours, causing trapped tractor trailers to sit idle. Health departments uh, should be coming out or on scene. I have not spoken with them and and they will let it monitor the situation, let us know we're having them come out to check off for the water runoff from the plant. Some residents said they're also concerned about the air quality. The smell from the chemicals uh, was burning some people's eyes that were out here earlier. Officials say the Richardson Fire Department hazmat team will monitor the situation as the investigation into what sparked the fire plays out. Very lucky. The chemical plants, you, you know, you never know. They could uh, do massive harm. These explosions were unreal. And as we come back out here live, you may be able to see that white command vehicle in the distance there with the satellite dish. It pulled up just moments ago. That is an environmental uh, EPA, Environmental Protection Agency vehicle. They have been asked to come out here by the city to conduct flyover air monitoring assessments of the situation here because some residents are concerned about air quality. I should also tell you that the city says it has also asked the Texas Commission on Environmental quality uh, to come out here and assist again with both uh, the air quality as well as concerns that some residents have about the water runoff as a result of uh, fighting this fire. Of course, it does remain under investigation. Back to you. All right, Alex Boyer reporting. Thank you, Alex.